Hello, we're here today to talk about how a student can sign in to Google at home and use all the different products and um, apps and so forth that we use at school. This will allow them to use Google Classroom, Prodigy, Extra Math, and access anything um, where it would have asked them to sign in using their Google account. Now up here in the upper right hand corner, you're going to see that I have this icon here that shows that somebody's already logged in. Well, what I want to do is I'm going to go ahead and click on this and I'm going to sign out. And once I've signed out, I'm going to go back up here and there's going to be a sign in button. When I click on this, I'm going to have some emails show up. And if your email student is not showing up here, then you're going to click where it says use another account. Here you're going to have to type in your email address that you have from school. Now remember this is going to be how you sign in in the morning. It's going to be, you know, um, probably something like um, your first initial, last name, and then some numbers. The same thing we do whenever you sign into a Chromebook. So I'm going to go ahead and sign in. I'm going to sign in as this account here. And the important part you're going to have to have at the end is not this uh, at Gmail stuff. You're going to have to delete that. Yours is going to say instead at Madison K12 dot AL dot US. Now this is the important part, the part that people are leaving off at home and why you're not able to log in at home. You have to have that part, the at Madison dot K12 dot AL dot US. So I'm going to go ahead at this time and in my email address then you're gonna have to type in your password now remember your password is going to be a uh, um, it's gonna say comments with a capital C and then a number after it just like you do in the morning when you sign in to a Chromebook at school now once you've done that you're gonna simply hit next and up here in the right hand corner it's gonna show you your icon where you have logged in now, from this point, you can go to any of the other sites you want to, like Prodigy, Google Classroom, and just use um, the click where it says um, sign in with a Google account. Now, Google Classroom is going to, in order to get there, you're simply going to pick these apps buttons here, and Google Classroom should show up. If not, simply search for Google Classroom in the search window here, and you just type in Google Classroom. And once it gets here, you click on this I, this uh, link here, and it'll take you to where you can go to Google Classroom. Now, this account I have here is not signed up for any. Anyways, that's all there is to it. So I hope this helps out and solves all the issues you're having at home. If not, feel free to contact me either through my phone number, which you should have, or through the school email address. Have a nice day.